Hello again guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, today we're going to be using a new rig to kind of counteract all of the previously seen issues with uh, the camera focusing on the background instead of, you know, usually when I want to look at something, like if I grab a pog, it zooms in pretty darn easy. And then once I take it away, it goes right to the background. I think that's going to be much more beneficial to us going forward with, you know, looking at figures or cards. And it just zooms right in and right back to there instead of trying to look at all the cool things that I have on my desk. Admittedly, it will be kind of sad that we don't see them as often, but they're still right up here. And we'll see them again, most likely in a video in the future. But for any of these opening videos, I just want the focus to be on the things that we're opening. So in a previous video that I uh, just uploaded recently, we took a look at a bunch of random things. One of the things in there was a Yu-Gi-Oh! item that I found at my local Hot Topic and had no idea what it was. Uh, I turned out to be one of the best purchases I had made because we got this awesome little fella in there, the Dabbing Blue Eyes figure. For those that don't know, the Blue Eyes White Dragon is my like favorite trading card of all time. Uh, my favorite creature out of all, of, you know, card games or the uh, collect-a-thon animes we got when we were younger. I love the Blue Eyes of Dragon, and especially that it looks like it's just dabbing is the greatest thing ever. So we're going to put that over there for now. But today, we're going to be taking a look at three of these completely unopened ones. And this one that I bought recently that I already know what's in it. But I thought I could open it up and just show you guys what's inside and a different figure. So we're going to start with this one first. Uh, it is Slifer the Sky Dragon. Yugi's God Card Monster. Now with the blue eyes, we had to pre-assemble like, assemble him. Like he's like three different pieces. I think it's the wings, the head, and the body or the base. But with Slifer, he looks like one entity. So we have him throwing the garbage out of here. With these, we also get like just a little card you can kind of show off with it or put next to it and you get this little stand. We're not gonna do this for all of them, but just to show everybody how this goes. You get that, you get that little, like looks like a game piece almost, like to a board game. And you just put that there. Um, we also get a base. So you can put your critter on. And boom, now he's a whole little figure. Uh, we also get a, I guess we'll do this one, just this one to kind of show anybody that hadn't watched the previous video, which if you haven't, you should. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. It helps me a lot. So you get this little thing. You get this that if I, oh, there we go. And you get this string. And we're going to do the string. Put it through. And look at you. You got like a dollar store version of a Millennium Puzzle necklace. Again, it might not seem all that cool for adults. But for kids, like, like I would have loved this as a kid. Like, I, I probably, my ass probably would have gone to school wearing this thing. Thinking I was the, like, the coolest kid but we're not going to do that for all of them i just wanted to show everybody what you get with that so we're going to put slifer nope, fell off his base put him over here with the blue eyes and now we're going to open three completely unopened ones that i just got today i have no idea what i could get in this uh i just kind of rolled the dice and wanted to see what i could get this will probably be the last time i get these um so let's see what we get It'd be cool if we got the other two god cards. Oh my god. Uh, oh no. Oh my god. Dude. The Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. The Ultimate Engine of Destruction times three? Bro. I hope there's a Dark Magician in here too. That'd be so sick. Or Exodia. That's so cool. And it looks like a nice little figure. Like it's nothing great. But, like, you know, we don't really get that many Yu-Gi-Oh! figures that are just widely, like, available. And we get the little card. I love that they got this, like, little, like, Majin symbol on them almost. That's so cool. 
So we got that. Let's get the base out. And boom. We have the Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. That's so cool. Um, all right. You know, like I said, I'm not going to do Millennium Puzzles every time we open this. But uh, let's see what we get. I would love a Dark Magician. Please let one of these be the Dark Magician. That'd be so cool. Or Exodia. I'm kind of doubting I'm going to get the other two God cards. But uh, at this point, you know, it'd be just cool. So let's see what we get. Oh, my God. Is that Jinzo? Oh my god! They did Jinzo! <laughs> I gotta look at After I'm done, maybe this isn't... I might have lied to you guys. This might not be the last time I buy these. Because, like, they really did Jinzo? Like, he kind of... Oh, and I bet you there's definitely, like, a red eyes, black dragon figure, too. That'd be really cool to have blue eyes and red eyes. And like I said, it looks like a really cool figure. Like, it, it's not really, like... All that, like, it, it doesn't look like it cheaped out or anything like that. Like, it's really cool. And of course, we get the card. That's so cool. I might have totally lied to you guys. I might. They're a little expensive. Um, I gotta say that right out the gate. I think it's, like, 15 bucks for one of these. Um, something like that. I, I don't remember exactly how much, but... You know, so if you're going to get them, I've only seen them at Hot Topics, so, you know, just so I don't hype these up for somebody and not tell you everything about them. Um, they are slightly expensive, and I've only been able to find them so far at Hot Topic stores. But with that, let's get into our last one. I'm still hoping for a Dark Magician. Obelisk would be really cool, having, you know, Yugi and Kaiba's ones, but, I mean, if Jinzo's in here, as long as it's not a double... God, this thing does not want to open. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> All right. My first double. That sucks, dude. I'm totally going to get another one of these at some point. I just know it. But, yeah, I'm not going to open him. We already we already know what to expect. He's over here. But, uh, you know, maybe that'll be a give giveaway in the future or something. I don't know. But... Um, I still need, hmm, I don't have any of my Yu-Gi-Oh, ah, not Yu-Gi-Oh, Pokemon cards. I don't have any Pokemon cards here to show you guys. So, let's try and make do with what we do have. I have a lot of coins. I got a whole mess of these Pokemon coins. I got a bunch of these. That's Eternatus. I got this really cool Celebration one. Um... Speaking of, I guess I should plant this seed early, but I like this one. There was like a really cool Eevee Vapor and Jolteon boxes. But recently, I just made a pretty large Pokemon card purchase that I will absolutely be recording and putting on this channel. Um, I have, a, I have, a, I think, a big Pokemon video coming down the line. Um, I'm probably expecting that maybe next week or the week after. I'm not 100% sure when I'll be recording that. But there is a very big Pokemon card video coming in the near future. So if you aren't subscribed yet, please subscribe. Be on the lookout for that. Uh, I think the bell icon also will like notify you. If you're not notified, uh, you know, you get notified when uploads happen or anything like that. Um, because I'm very excited for this video. It's going to be, I think at least, a very big Pokemon video. I'm very excited for it. And I think you should be too. Um, I don't know. Oh, the Detective Pikachu one. I love this one. I have the metal version of that too. Um, there's a bunch in here. Maybe I'll show some more down the line. Oh, this is the Marnie one. I got this when I bought the Marnie box. I forgot I had this. Um, but yeah, uh, I think that's going to do it for me today. Let's get these little dudes out here. Oh, Slifer does not want to stand on the podium. Um, just to show what we have. Uh, I will say, though, I it's weird that Blue Eyes is like just kind of plain. But Blue Eyes Ultimate is like shiny, kind of. I don't know. I'm really happy with this. I'm I'm totally happy. Hello? You zoomed in too good. It's too too good to be true. I really like these guys. Um, I'm probably going to get in more in the future. I think, though, I'm going to do a little bit more research and see what all is in the set and get an idea of what I could get. Because 
Uh, I don't want to keep shooting and get Jinzos and Slifers all day long, but I'm imagining Karibo, Exodia, probably Dark Magician, Dark Magician Girl. If we have Slifer, we probably have Raw and Obelisk in this set, so there's probably... Uh, I can't even imagine. I'd assume Red Eyes, too. If we have Blue Eyes, we got to have Red Eyes, Black Dragon. I don't know. I'll have to look into it more, but uh, I probably lied and you'll see this again um so that's gonna do it for me guys i hope you have a great rest of your day night whatever time it is when you're watching this i really appreciate you guys helping me let me know what you guys think about the new setup uh i think it worked out really well a couple times it was a little but i think this worked out a lot better than the other setup um but otherwise uh i'll see you guys soon remember to subscribe if you haven't and keep an eye out for that very big pokemon video that i'm gonna keep hyping up until i finally record it <laughs> bye guys